with all of the serious issues that are facing this country right now, it is truly sad and ridiculous that we are spending serious media time talking about the First Lady's trip to Spain, which was a private trip. And everybody can go back and forth about which money was spent on a particular meeting or she was involved in some type of governmental business. But really, ladies and gentlemen, we've reached a point where nothing a president does Democratic or Republican is going to be able to satisfy people of the opposite party. If the First Lady decided to go to California, they would ask the question, well, why didn't she go and vacation in New Orleans? It really doesn't matter. People are damned if they do and damned if they don't. Furthermore, though, people are talking about this isn't a good time to take a vacation. I walked into the Apple store today and the guy told me that the iPhone 4s are selling out and they can't even keep them fast enough because people are always taking those, taking iPads. They're constantly selling out. We had a movie called Avatar, which during this recession quote-unquote, became the highest grossing movie ever. People are spending buying products not made in America all day long. Where are these senators vacationing this month? Are people looking into that? The fact of the matter is people are just looking and clamoring for something to hate on as it relates to Michelle Obama. And this is truly sad because these people who are hating on her are not going to give her credit when she's out there promoting programs like obesity out here in communities like Southeast D.C. where I live, talking to young girls about the dangers of teen pregnancy. And they're not going to give her those types of props, but they want to condemn her for spending some time with her children. This is truly truly ridiculous and I believe that anybody who's out there critiquing her when we got real issues going on such as illegal immigration, concerns over terrorism, the economy, people who are doing that, you're really a loser and you really have nothing better to do with your life to try to stir up some controversy like President Obama is mad at Michelle and that's why they're not traveling together. You all got to get a life for real.